and welcome to Portland Place or Thing. Come along with me. No, no wait, no, this is a different show. Okay, uh, I'm Kat, and I will be your host this evening. Amanda had a show to go to, so this is all my gig. So let's kick it. Um, let me introduce just our panelists. We don't have any activities. It's just going to be some bare bones cluster fuckedness. All right. So to my left, we have Andrew, who would have gotten away with it if it weren't for those meddling kids. Uh, <laughs> to my right, I have Neil, who will also be our little music man and a grown up big boy music man uh, later on in the show. And the usual activity superhero, we have Brandon. He's going to join us, get to chatting about some cartoons. That's right, we're just going to talk about cartoons because I love them. I mean, you love them. There's all different types. They're so much fun. When we started researching all of this, it was like rabbit hole after rabbit hole of different aspects of cartoons. So um, let's, uh, let's start it and kick it off. Um, also, feel free to randomly shout out your favorite cartoon catchphrases as they just come to you. Or sound effects such as Goofy's that sort of thing. You're more than welcome to. Hi, Caramba. There you go. That's my mama. <laughs> what is that one? From Family Guy. Oh, okay. Just wait. It, All is, right. it is. I'll believe you. I'll, believe I'll you. buy that yeah, one. Yeah. I'll show you guys after. <laughs> All right. So... Let's uh, let's start with uh, childhood, shall we? <laughs> <laughs> let's go, we? Usually do. Let's go way back. Um, does it? Do any of you have like favorite cartoons from uh, your childhood that you remembered? Like mm. in a bunch. I was a really big Ninja Turtles fan back mm -hmm. in the day. Solid. Yeah, back before Michael Bay ruined it. They look gross, right? Yeah, they really do. They look. Yeah. Disgusting. Though I then realized later, looking back, that all of the pizza topping and, uh, combinations actually look really pretty gross. On the cartoon? Yeah. I mean... No, it's not where their budget went for animation. <laughs> yeah. It's true. <laughs> it's hard to animate, you know, just normal, delicious toppings. Like, yeah, well, not like when you have Ninja cheese, Turtles on like screen. It, it ends up looking just goopy and oozy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What about you, Brandon? Uh, well, I, yeah, I was also a huge Turtles fan. I uh, also, I was huge, basically, I guess, because of the toys. The commercial thing worked. He-Man, when I was younger, I used mm -hmm. to watch yeah. the heck out of that show. Um, which, apparently, they've continued on in, like, comics. And there's, like, a continuing storyline that's been going since I was a kid that was a show created for a toy commercial. But, apparently, there are people that are huge into it. And, like, Skeletor's dead, apparently. Oh, Aww. Isn't that Should like de facto that? by the whole like Skeletor thing? <laughs> no, but I mean he's no oh, longer yeah. animate. <laughs> oh, I see. Sure. So, sure. so they've stretched out the story of an oiled, muscly guy waving a sword around. Yeah, it's called fan fiction. Yeah, all right. Apparently so, the bad so that's guys how probably from Shira yeah. are now how Skeletor the died. bad guy. Okay, I don't know much about He Man, so no. I'm just gonna absolutely believe and um, take it on faith. Uh, what about you, Andrew? I think I'm the only panelist here old enough to have watched the first season of The Simpsons. We own it. I own it. Does I'm, that count? Wait, Live what? as it aired. Oh, I no. Was, nope. I was there. I'm making fun of you. This is why you're not allowed to talk. Oh. Know your role. Brandon's new. It's fine. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I was not alive, I don't think, when it aired. What year did it air? I don't even remember anymore. I, Isn't it like 20 some odd seasons of that show? It's, yeah, yeah, it's like 25. Like, it's, which, yeah. Yeah, I mean, after yeah, number seven, they were just stretching out. I was mm. old enough to watch it while it aired on the Tracy Ullman show. That was... Mm. Nice. I, eh, Simpsons are fine. I don't know. I didn't really... At the time, it's what there was. Watched it a whole bunch. And a large, I suspect a large part of it for young adult or young kids at the time we were, is we weren't supposed to because Bart Simpson's a terrible role model. Yeah. Mm. And then when we became old enough to be actual, have critical thinking skills, we realized it was trash and moved on. <laughs> I think that they, they brought a lot to the table that wasn't there before and they pioneered like a lot of great TV. Yeah. Um, yeah. 
But, I mean, every show goes through ups and downs, and some things are going to hit and be fantastic and popular, and then other things aren't. Yeah, and have you seen now that there's a new internet hubbub about The Simpsons, about that Apu sh shouldn't be a character now because of the racist stereotype? No. That's a big internet thing going on right now, mm. apparently. I would not be entirely surprised. Um. It, it's funny that it took this long, though. It's like, it's been going for 25 years. Oh, by the way. Like, I don't know. I, I feel like trying to retroactively make something politically correct is terrible. It's counterproductive. Like, How could Tolkien have named his book The Two Towers? Clearly he's being disrespectful <laughs> of 9-11. <laughs> Obviously. I wish that wasn't a real petition. Are you serious? Yeah, no, that was an actual petition. Oh. They had to rename it because he wasn't, you know, they're naming this movie The Two Towers and that's not respectful. Hmm. It's like, I, okay. Yay. The double skyscrapers? I yeah. could be a good you're showing us, like, three or four things wrong with American culture at once. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Normally it takes three sentences to cram that much terrible. I don't... Yeah, I don't we're on the other side. Okay, no. Happy thing. So, I'm going to move us along, because F all this sadness. <laughs> what are some good cartoons that we've seen recently? I am a fan of Rick and Morty, apparently the creator of which Amanda's going to slip a roofie to tonight. Yeah. And whose name I will get wrong each and every time. <laughs> Donald Hammond. Um. <laughs> uh, I'm a big Adventure Time fan myself. Yeah. I know you alluded yeah. to that at the beginning Ooh. of the show. Mm -hmm. Brandon couldn't get into it. I tried to get him to watch it. We watched Korra together. We watched Steven Universe together. Like we've had some cartoon times. Could not get him. I I also didn't. Uh, I feel like the the Christmas episode when. Mm -hmm. You know, it's sweater time, and they watch the videos, and you first learn about Ice King Biz. Oh yeah. I feel like yep. that would pull him in, but for the most part, it like, gets it gets very dark at times. It does. I've seen it none really of does. this. It's uh, post-apocalyptic. Uh, it's very like man. I've totally cried during that show. I've laughed. I've vomited. I've I've uh, you know just lost control of my bowels because of just how great it is it's fantastic Remind are you watching to watch the show with him i well yeah <laughs> like, you should at least bring like a like a rain slick kind I'm of imagine a, like a yeah. shot of schnapps every it. time someone says adventure because I mean, how else you get in that state they do say that a lot tarp. yeah turn into like some sort of a gallagher guar concert thing. yeah why am i not making money off of this yeah, I feel like... Seriously, no, you are failing to use the internet to its full potential. <laughs> You're right. I could have so many YouTube followers. Uh, by the way, speaking of YouTube, have you guys ever seen How To Basic on YouTube? No. I think I've seen a few. Well, I'll, I won't go into it. You should just go look it up if you, if on, you can. Online. Online. On the... <laughs> on the internet. The internet thing. <laughs> <laughs> we can't say websites. It's fine. Yeah, we have tap dance around it for some reason. Yep. H. Yep. H internet. H. H not, not internet. Dot. H. But on know. your local internet video hosting site. <laughs> or international, it's fine. Your preferred video local, hosting site. Your preferred, site. yes. Um, now DRM taken down. Do you, well, do you guys still watch, like, do you still watch The Simpsons? Do you still watch no. He Man or Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles at all? No. I went back to watch an episode of The Simpsons when they did the crossover with Futurama. Mm -hmm. Or Family Guy. Yeah, no, the Futurama one sucked. The Family Guy crossover. Mm -hmm. This is how clear my brain is. I thought today was the one we show up drunk. My mistake. <laughs> yeah, we already did that one. <laughs> yeah, I know, but I wanted to repeat. That's okay. Do better this time. But, um, no, it, it just became sad. Uh, uh -huh. Well, I'm sure there are parts of it that are humorous. It just whatever it was that made it amusing in the first place, it doesn't have for me anymore. You I, grow out of stuff. Yeah, yeah I, and into t worse things. <laughs> I actually continue to enjoy SpongeBob SquarePants, which I wasn't expecting, but it is actually a very funny show at times. There's a, do you know about the, the uh, Seven Deadly Sins theory? No. Okay, so. 
There's a theory that all of the characters represent a different sin. Oh, wow. And SpongeBob is like kind of the, the most stretched sort of concept that he's lust, like a lust for life kind of thing. Oh. But mm. I would uh, call him Dante little, just little walking through the th circles. That one, that one was They're like the, the, yeah, the biggest reach. Um, um, anger. I mean, I can definitely see Mr. Mr. Krabs is greed. Yeah, yeah, he okay. was greed. Uh, pride is what's the Squidward? squirrel? Oh, no. um, squirrel chick. Sandy. Sandy. Sandy is pride. Um, Squidward, I believe, was anger. That sounds right. R wrath. Wrath. Um, his uh, Gary, his snail was um, gluttony, and Patrick was sloth. Hmm. Am I missing one? Uh, envy. Envy. Well, oh no, that's right. Squidward was envy. Oh, okay. And the little yeah. tiny dude was anger. Oh, was oh yeah, I know you're talking. Yeah. Plankton or whatever. Yeah. Nice. Little tiny guy. I don't know. Little I thought that was villain. in all of our research. I thought that was a weird. That is interesting. Theory. How much research did you guys do on cartoons? That more than probably need be. Also, I just mm. watch cartoons. Yeah, it's justifying <laughs> it's justifying the just usual watch binge watching and calling it research. <laughs> yeah, that sounds about right. Counts. It's fine. But I mean, I looked up trivia stuff and whatever. I don't know. It was fun. Somebody's just opening our door. It is just the most ridiculous episode. I it's feel fun. very alone in this area right now. We are right completely now. alone. Yeah. I want everyone to, at home to understand that right now there are no camera people in this room. There's no audience. There's just you and us. Hey, Bill, how's it going? So let's have ourselves a personal mm. chat, just you and us, <laughs> about cartoons. <laughs> These are very large webcams. <laughs> Yep. Should I start? No, no. Okay. Um, what's your least favorite cartoon? Let me find that out. Scooby Doo. It's easy. I. It's so. I mean, I appreciate your reference and your name. Um, that was all me. We just came up. With okay. Me. Okay. I, I mean, like he's a villain. There, there's okay. aspects of it I appreciate about it, but actually sitting through an episode of it is very difficult for me. It's like the same thing over and over and over again. Yeah, especially mm. like the scenes where there's just someone running and the background is repeating over and over again. Mm -hmm. yeah, I it feel like animating costs. I, I feel like I'm that person when I'm watching it. Like I'm just <laughs> running through an endless hallway and I can't get out of it. So. Well, that's sad. This is an oddly sad episode. <laughs> yeah, it, let's <laughs> talk cartoons and be depressed. Be sad and talk cartoons. Maybe now that Tony's in the room, it'll cheer us up because we have a friend. Maybe. See, my most hated one. He's is, just getting uh, me out of the picture. Yeah. Is one. It's a. It's actually an anime. It's called. Is it Fooly Cooly? Oh it's yeah. F L C L. Yeah. People always want to talk well about it, and it's terrible. And it, it's. I s sat through most of if not the entire season going okay there's going to be a plot at some point this is all going to make sense it isn't just a bunch of random gibberish that's that was your first mistake and it's yeah it's a bunch of random gibberish yes oh. i've found like the neckbeard probably gives away that i've watched an anime or two in my day <laughs> The only redeeming trait that it tends <laughs> the only redeeming trait it tends to have is it comes from a different culture, in that because I don't know the tropes intrinsically, I'm not just like oh it's just that again, but some of the tropes are just flat out terrible because again different culture where it makes right. zero sense to me. Right. The um, soundtrack is great though. Soundtracks are usually pretty good. Really cool. Yeah, it's it's this it's Japanese literally. like punk band kind of, <laughs> and every once in a while they throw in an English word just in the middle of all the Japanese. Yeah, yeah. That yeah. happens a lot. <laughs> yeah. Well, I English think... is cool there. Like, the random Japanese word is cool here. So cool. Well, that's like, um, there's, actually, there was an anime that I really enjoyed. Yeah, I haven't watched it in a number of years, but it's, it was called Macross Plus. It was that part of familiar. the, it was a continuation oh, of the Macross Saga, which was more or less portrayed here in America as Robotech people might recognize but anyway right, it's people who pilot jets that turn into robots nice. okay the soundtrack of that there's because there's a character that's sort of this digital pop singer one of the tracks is a song from a it's a Japanese pop song 
sung in French, but then there's another vocal track that's really quiet. Now I'm it's in English. Out of there we and go. one day we were listening to it, and I suddenly realized that it is really dirty. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's like I would like to be holding you, stroking you up and down. Do you feel my penis. juices around? And we're just like, whoa. I mean, that could be talking like, about something innocent. I, I suppose. You know, well, it's circumventing a, a lot of um, laws regarding such things only govern the, la the native language of the country. It's why Firefly, they swore in Chinese, like sailors. Hmm. Because the FCC Get didn't care. <laughs> or, I mean, the, you've always got the... Uh, Battlestar Galactica approach of just you make right. your own curse word and just replace it. Right. Like a find and replace for the whole terrible universe. Oh my glob. Ah, frack. Mathematical. Yeah, by the way, I, I, when I first heard them saying like, oh my glob mm -hmm. in, in Adventure Time, I thought, oh, they, it's just kind of like a weird little one-off thing that they said. But then they start, now you you realize there's like a character named glob who's yeah. like a super, you know, advanced creature or something yeah, yeah. and I kind of wonder if they just if they did it as a one-off thing and they were like ah, actually let's make this a, a, a major <laughs> part of the show yeah yeah no no it's I totally feel like they made Tony's totally gonna collapse by the time we're done because every time one of us starts talking he has to <laughs> run in adjust the camera run back out <laughs> so Brandon and I need to just have a conversation that switches <laughs> every time he moves the camera and leaves the room like, we'll just be quiet you guys can just torture Tony <laughs> um <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. No. Abby God says we have to keep talking about cartoons and not about Tony. What do you mean? There's actual guidelines for what we're doing here? <laughs> There's an outline. We spent hours on it. The, does it have uh, a topic paragraph? This is what I say no. to you. That's, um, a, that's not a sentence. It's a gesture. <laughs> where are we at in our outline? Oh, uh, we're fine. Who cares I'm going to I'm going to kick out Neil. Okay. Yeah. To right. go, uh, you go get go ready. Get ready. Go get your guitar Brandon and I will torture Tony. You could just leave that there. Right there. Yeah, it'll be fine. Everybody say bye, Neil. Bye. Bye, Neil. We'll see you later. Hopefully. I mean, this is our favorite show to bail on on a Sunday. It is. It's <laughs> everyone's favorite show to bail on, which sounds really passive aggressive and mean, but we're not trying to be that way. All right. I am. So uh, we're going to keep talking for a little bit while... Uh, Neil gets all ready to uh, croon. Melt our brains. Yeah, yeah. But with soft, nice music. Not or that. loud, nice music. I don't I, uh, I heard a little bit of it earlier, and it sounded delightful. So, um, did you ever say your least favorite cartoon? I don't think you did. Tell me your least favorite cartoon. I think I said just general brands of cartoons I dislike. I'm not sure I have one I can just summon up as least because I'm judgmental and quick to turn away from them. Mm -hmm. So everything other than the few I watch, <laughs> um, I mean, you know, a lot of anime, trash, a lot of Adult Swim, sadly trash. Some of it, amazing. Yep, some of it's fantastic. Super Jail, baffling. Usually amazing. trash. Usually trash. I love it. I love it. I understand. <sighs> that at two in the morning, you probably want to watch Seizure Inducing Gibberish. Absolutely. Some of right us before don't. Bed. Give me them good dreams. Um, <laughs> all right, everybody. Yep. Neil, are you ready? I, I think so. You I look ready. ready. I yeah. hope you're ready because our right. red light went out. <laughs> I know. There we everybody, go. Everybody, give it up for Neil Wright. Woo! Woo! Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> uh, okay, that's that's fine. Domingo, you're my favorite little kitty You've got a lot of things to say, at least I think so anyway But I can't understand the things coming out of your face Cause I'm not part of the kitty race Domingo, you're my favorite little furball You've got a lot of things to do You've got some paper bags to chew And some stuff to knock off of the shelf When you're sitting home by yourself
to mingle you that type of guy who keeps his roommates up all night your meow is like a siren's call to mingle when you take a nap and curl up softly on my lap i don't have a care at all to mingle i know you really love me i'm sorry i go away sometimes i just assume you will be fine cause you got such an intelligent mind But it's nice to have a partner in crime Domingo You're my favorite little kitty You were out there on the streets And now you're hanging out with me Ain't that a hell of a thing just writing that as you were like walking through the house like singing to your kitty or whatever like uh, everyone should do I got invited to do a show gotta pound something out real quick <laughs> I, in fact I was just sitting there on my couch and he was being very cute while I was playing guitar and it just came to me and I just started writing it it was a true wonderful. love story oh thank yeah. you thank you it's like a perfect representation of what thousands of people sing at their kitties all the time. <laughs> but like in nice, poetic, beautiful. Oh, thank you. I'm glad you liked it. The, oh. the second song is also about my other pet. <laughs> nice. Which Fantastic. Is a, which is a snake. So. so when you need inspiration, you just go strolling through the zoo. Yeah. Which is why <laughs> I have way too many pets. Bat cage full of guano up to my knees. <laughs> All right, All right, guys, I have a game that. for you. Huzzah! Yay. I have a game for you. We're going to play Cartoon Zoom. The way this okay. goes is that we've uh, taken pictures of cartoons, movies, cartoon movies, um, and uh, we've zoomed in on a section, and you have to guess what the movie or cartoon is. Ooh. It's all Alrighty. animated. And uh, I'm going to do this one slowly in case Tony wants to come back and make it so that it can be seen. All right. <laughs> oh, it's upside down. Hold on. I fixed it. Oh, that's Totoro. I want to I want to say Animaniacs, but I could also see Totoro as well. Nothing Totoro's you got. That's a good guess. I got right, it. It's my never Totoro. Yeah. Yay! No idea what that is. All right. It's good anime. Oh, that's oh, Mulan. Wow. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> He's good. These are really easy, by the way. Yay! Mulan! Ooh. Yay! Let's get down to business, you guys. I might have to, to yield my role as the, the internet. <laughs> oh, I know this one, too. But too. I'll let other people. Finding Nemo! There we go. Yeah. Finding Nemo. You're right! <laughs> Yay! These are cumbersome. Apparently, apparently I feel like I need a head start on these. Like oh. Bart Simpson. I know, but what's the cartoon? Uh, Bart... Uh, Bart's World. Bart Simpson oh versus the Space Mutants. No, wait. It's, no, it's got that name. It's that one thing. It's it, the Bar yeah. Sklimpson. Um, what movie would... Is it like American Family or... No, wait. Uh, wait, no. Yellow um, Peoples. Doctor Strange Love or How I Fell in Love with the Bomb. bomb. And the, the animated series. Yes. <laughs> Doctor Rocky Horror Show. <laughs> oh, yeah, The Simpsons. Hey, Neil! <laughs> Neil I got nailed it. it. I got it. All he right. nailed it. <laughs> I like that. Oh, how to train your drag queen? <laughs> yeah, it is how to train your dragon. Yay! Right. So these are the harder ones. Oh, whoa! It's just a little symbol. Spider Man. 
Oh. It's too bad no one else is here to appreciate this yeah. high production value we have going on with these. Um, I know, right? I worked hard. Uh, can I cheat? I need an edge up on this. Yeah, Spider Man. You can cheat because I'm sure you saw it as I was two. trying to hold it close to my chest. I'm just going to randomly guess The Legend of Korra. All right. Uh, I did not actually successfully see it. Oh, ha ha ha. All right. Well, I'm too well uh, trained I feel to lunge at your awesome chest because I guessed it when I first looked at it. It's Charlotte's Web. Oh, oh that's Charlotte. Oh, so delightful. Yes. Spider Man was I, pretty close though. Spider Man was a solid guess. That was the first yeah. book to ever make me cry. How about this one? Uh oh, I Nick, saw this one earlier, Nicky? so I can't say. Wait. I it's the it's... best animated movie of all time. Uh, no. Helsing. I, I once, wa when they watched it, they played it 24 hours know. straight on TNT at one point. And Cure for insomnia? Wallace and Gromit? I watched it like five times. Some kind of Wallace and Gromit thing? No. It is not Wallace and Gromit. War of the Worlds? It stars uh, the voice of Vin Diesel. Iron Giant? Yep, you're right. Iron oh. Giant. Holy crap. Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, Vin Diesel is the voice of Iron Giant? Yes. Yep. Nice. And that's the end of Cartoon Zoom. Wasn't it fun? Woo! Woo! Who won? I think uh, that's pretty clear. matters and points matter. I'm and... fairly certain that Andrew did not win. Indeed. Oh. That's what I know. Burn. <laughs> I accept that my mental storage is tied up with useful trivia. I think we can agree after the kitty song, Neil is the winner in all of our hearts. Mm -hmm. Oh, thanks, you guys. But you only get... <laughs> You only get two <laughs> points for that. All right. Mm. So uh, let's let's talk about not. Uh, I mean, we're gonna continue talking about cartoons. The next section on our outline was controversial cartoons, which we've already mm. sort of been talking about. But the internet kind of makes everything controversial at this mm -hmm. point. Well, I think any cartoon that has wizards or rock and roll is very controversial and it's the it's satan's playground it's at frankly. least a gateway to satan worship yeah yeah i mean that's how Absolutely. i got into it yep there has to be an animation of some sort named satan's playground probably i might probably. have to go to at least somebody an like internet project. website <laughs> and search for that we could always there's probably a numerical rule that governs it in fact Ah. It is greater than 33, but less than 30 35. <laughs> oh. Uh, oh, gosh. That's probably true. Uh, uh. But uh, we could talk about Muhammad, the prophet Muhammad, being cartoonified. We could talk about that. It is we controversial. We did not research that. Peace be on we his name. Like, but it's in Butthead, South Park. It has led oh, yeah. to at least one building explosion. <laughs> yeah. yeah. What, Charlie Hebdo? The French building? The Charlie yeah, Hebdo, I believe. And yeah. it has led to some South Park episodes being redacted. And wasn't, wasn't Despite, there like that, that protest by a bunch of the bikers that like it was like earlier the week they went around a mosque and sat out front with like guns and drew the prophet muhammad in front it of just, them i have no yeah. idea well yeah like it it seems like i don't know you're just like trying to cause trouble it's not like by you're trying to by... respect anybody's anything even if you find something absurd or whatever like don't you have something better to do? You have a hobby or... Wait, who are we lashing out at the moment now? Of? The people doing the drawings or the people who get offended by it? I believe that one was, it was religion It's in just general. so Yeah, it's just sort in of general. religion. Like, okay. Just like have your religion and like do what, what you feel is right in your religion or whatever. But when you're like going out and, and obviously trying to like have an effect on other people based on theirs, like what what is the point? You know what you could do? You could clean your bathroom. I think clean the top of your fridge. When was the last time you did that? As the needs to get done. As the vocal atheist, I actually have an answer to that. But this is probably not the right show for it. <laughs> See, I think everyone so should just <laughs> worship whatever globs they want. <laughs> <laughs> Don't act like you're an Adventure Time fan now. I'm not. I'm you're just stealing not. that term. <laughs> In the future, there will be world peace, and everyone will have really clean houses. Oh. And they'll all be white because apparently that's the most efficient color for a house to be. Solar-wise? 
That sounds like are you talking efficiency power? <laughs> Stop right there. Wait. Uh, I just want gray houses. It's fine. You want everything gray. I know. Except for the things that are orange. Yeah, orange and gray. That's it. Gray for days. Real this. Serving. Okay. Um. Yeah. So, uh, so now that, that was not really Kingdom <laughs> Town yeah. Now that we've really offended a chunk about, uh, of our core fan yeah, base, yeah. Uh, and explain why there's no one else in the building with us currently. <laughs> Like, oh crap, because they're talking. explode? Yeah, they're talking cartoons, and Andrew That's will fair. be there, so let's. But for the people who watch all the way to the end, they will get the big surprise reward. So. There may be cookies. That has been totally planned and will absolutely be happening. There's there's cake. There's cake. Cake, cake, cake. cake. <laughs> oh, there we go. Sorry, I just heard. Never mind. Uh, there will not be cake in the worry. studio. Food is not cake, allowed. We're it's gonna... cake, a.k.a. granola bars in the green room. Hell yeah. There will be cake. I might draw a cake for you during the credits. Ooh. Ooh. Maybe. Um, so now we're going to uh, use up a little bit of our time. Our friend Kit Voss submitted some of her um, animations that she did in school or for fun or all of the things. Um, so we're going to cut to those now, thanks to our patron saint, Kate. Praise be to Kate. And uh, and the hard work of our off-camera crew. Yeah. Without whom this actually wouldn't happen for all we give them a hard time. Yeah. Please don't cut us off. No, they're doing great. Um, so we're going to cut to that right now. Well, what this guy look like, anyways? Oh, he's a little guy, kind of funny looking. Uh-huh. In what way? Oh, just in a general kind of way. Looks like she's going to turn cold tomorrow. Oh, yeah. Got a front coming in. Yeah, you got that right. Now, watch this, everybody. Grab my arm. The other arm. My other arm. Okay, now watch this. I'm just going to break the wrist and walk away. Break the wrist, walk away. Jeez. Okay, it's just that simple. I want chicken, I want liver, meow mix, meow mix, please deliver. Isn't that fantastic? Super uh, fun, right? Wow. You guys are lying. They did not watch it. I totally we weren't allowed. It. This is my fake they, excitement. You're supposed to use those. Oh, sorry. Right. This is <laughs> my <laughs> fake hair. Apparently I'm lustful when excited. Yeah. This is my excited mouth. And my hand is <laughs> in front of my Your eyeballs are your excited mouth? 
They're kind of mustachey. That 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 actually works. <laughs> Um, Those, when, thank you, you. when you don't put it above his face, they look like boobs. <laughs> or you could do like a like a visor kind of. Ooh, you know. yeah. super cool. <laughs> <laughs> He's like some, Jordy LaFord. Kind of like yeah, Jordy Cyclops, maybe. Jordy LaFuckable. Uh, thank oh. you, Kit. <laughs> For those wonderful animations, they're fantastic and super fun. I really enjoyed them. Um, and also I look forward to seeing them. She's, yeah, yeah, you do. Uh, she's also responsible for the awesome kitty backflip that happens in our title screen. Because that's how advanced we are. We may have nobody in the studio, but we can put video on our CG, son. All I right. Pay people <laughs> to flip cats, apparently. Yeah, we can just use other people's footage. Um, so we have a another game! Yay! Yay! Another more cartoon games. I have trivia. Everybody well, fucking I lose. loves trivia. So happy about this. <laughs> okay, are you guys ready? I Who am now. Who wants to go first? Uh, oh, is it like you're gonna ask one person and then move on? Yeah, if you don't guess it correctly. All right, start with me. I'll set the bar nice and low. All right, Andrew. All right. Paul Winchell, the inventor and patent holder for the first artificial heart, was also the voice of what Disney character? Na, 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 thank you. Ariel the Mermaid. No. Brandon, going to you. Goofy. No. Pinocchio. Everybody's wrong. It's Tigger. <laughs> He voiced Tigger. All right. T I W G er. Brandon, what's the E stand for in Wild E Coyote? Extreme. That's not a name. <laughs> That's wrong. What's. <laughs> uh, Edmund. That's fair guess, but it's wrong. Elijah. Again, fair guess. It's Ethelbert. Because I guess that's the name. <laughs> Ethelbert. What meal was the first cartoon to ever be done fully with CGI? Um, hmm. I want to say it's not like Toy Story is too. No, that's not. Okay, that's I'll, I'll, way after. Um, first movie that was first cartoon far, first cartoon first cartoon if i said oh movie, uh reboot yeah nailed it that show sucks i watched so much reboot as a child i never watched it i just knew it was in 3d and that that was the first one i could think of as well mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yeah it's the one that was fully cg i guess canada picked it up canada was a big fan of it Apparently they they're remaking weird it. Places. Hmm. Apparently they're remaking it, like um, modern day, because we need mind. more of that it was story. A, it was yeah. a show about the internet. It was a show about. It, I don't like, think it was the internet. It was games. Were they like programs on a computer? Yeah, it was like the computer games that would come in. It's and like what happens to the hard drive when they do a bad Google search? Yeah. Basically. Rule 34 reboot. You don't mention the numbers. <laughs> Public <laughs> access television. We can get naked, but we have to keep it clean. Speaking of numbers, how old is Garfield, Andrew? Fuck if I know, 40. All right, that's actually kind of close. Brandon? Lasagna? That's not a number, <laughs> Neil? <Get> close <laughs> as you can without going over. It's like uh, Price is right. Yeah, it's Price is right. One dollar, one dollar. <laughs> All right. He's 37. Uh, so I think Neil won that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Uh, By getting Garfield? one answer. You got Garfield. <laughs> this, um, yeah. What year? Brandon, this goes Brandon. Brandon, what year did Cartoon Network start? <gasps> oh, I think I know this. 1996. No. Good guess. 98. No. Farther away. Oh. Andrew, what do you think? Start. C Lab 2021? That's not right. <laughs> Nobody knows how to do trivia. One dollar. Oh. It was uh, earlier than expected. Yes. Yeah. They were really? they were out there. That's crazy. It was surprising. Huh. Neil, when yeah. is the only time that Donald Duck wears pants? <sighs> um when he's naked and taking a shower. 
It's like the opposite of humans. Um, it's, uh, okay, Andrew, you're going to have to dig a little bit deeper. It's kind of close to that. Okay. It's that same basic premise. When does he wear pants? I need to dig deeper into a naked duck. Yep. <laughs> Do it. When he's cross-dressing? No. When he goes to bed? <laughs> pajama bottoms? No. I... When he goes swimming. Oh. Oh, oh. like a swimming. Because he has to take his top dress. off so he can't be naked. Um, who? Who's it? And Andrew? Is sure. It Andrew? You can skip me again. It's good. What's the question? Oh, you could, I think you could get this one. Who were the first cartoon couple to be seen sleeping in the same bed? Oh. Scum. Oh. Devil's work. Oh. That is totally devil's work. Wait, wait, are they married, though? Yeah. Oh, that's fine. The devil? Oh, I right. think I know this one. I'm going to say Homer and Marge, because they're the first cartoon couple I saw in the same bed. That's a good guess, but no, no. The Flintstones. The Flintstones! Ding, yes. ding, ding, Brandon. Sorry, I thought they were about more wholesome things, like smoking. Oh, my God. <laughs> um, Brandon, what cartoon talk show has rocks on Mars named after the main characters, and what are those names? I'm guessing Space Ghost, Coast to Coast? Yeah, you're right! Really? Nailed That's it! That's cool. And, what uh, are their names? That's Just why there's a part two. Zorak and, and Brack and Space Ghost? And? Uh, I don't know. Wait, oh. Huh? Z -z 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 huh? Wait, no, what is his name? Huh? Neil for the Steel? Huh? It's the guy with the mask. It is the guy with the mask! I don't remember his name. Moltar! Moltar. I was going to say Zoltar, but I was like, no, that doesn't make sense because Zorak. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's too many Zs. Uh, yeah. All right, Neil. Tracy Grandstaff, the voice of Daria, now holds what title at Comedy Central? Unemployed. No. No. No, that is oh, well, kind that's, of the opposite. I'm glad. Yeah. She's, totally she's employed. Good. Totally employed? Totally employed. What, uh, what title is it? I may have come up with a new one then. Um, phone a plumber tester? No, no. Because they need to be tested. Their plumber? The plum plumbing? The phones. <laughs> Plums? Plums need to be tested? The plumbers. <laughs> Which plumbers? You mm. dial one up. Andrea Scalia arrives in under 10 minutes. She takes him for a test, sends him home. Move on to Brandon. <laughs> VP of programming. You know what? I'm going to give it to you. She's yeah. vice president. Oh. She's right. just what? straight up vice president. I knew she would. Well, good. She it's would make it going eventually. On. You don't even know who she was. I do. I do. Morgendorfer <laughs> is her last name, for example. Wait, is that right? Daria Morgendorfer? Oh, sure. That's. I think that's probably Yeah, that correct. is right. Yeah. Um, uh, I'm going to ask this to... Daria is... <laughs> Uh, I'm going to ask this to Neil because uh, he hates Scooby-Doo. Oh, what God. made Casey Kasem quit voicing Shaggy after two decades in 1995? When they had Shaggy learning um, magic, which is obviously forbidden by the Bible. Wrong. Damn it. It's a good, good try. Good damn try. it. How about you, Andrew? Shaggy mocked Scientology. That's actually a really good guess, but that is not true either. How about you? The episode of Harvey Birdman where they insinuated that the, the uh, Scooby characters were actually doing drugs? No, this is 1995 before that episode ah. ever was a thing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, the show's producers asked him to do a Burger King commercial. He was vegan. Oh, mm. that makes sense. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. He does have that smooth vegan voice. <laughs> no hint of suffering coming out. Right. Mm -hmm. um, two more questions. All and right. then uh, <laughs> we're done. Actually, I'm going to give these two questions to Brandon and Andrew. Neil, okay. why don't right. you unhook? If I know the answer, you just shout it out. Just shout I'll it shout, out. Just shout, shout it out. out All right. Da, 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 give it up for Neil. He's going to be great. Wait. The three original Warner Brothers on the Animaniacs were Wacky, Smacky, and Yacky. What types of animals were they? The original three, not the ones that were on there. 
Guesses? I'm gonna guess there's a zebra in there. No. Yeah. Kangaroo? One of things, yeah. Not a yak, but good guess. I'm guessing it's genetic abominations. Genetic abominations. Uh, ducks. So, so yeah. yeah, yeah, corkscrew cocks. All right. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> and the final question: When Transformers first arrived in Japan, what was it called? Anybody? I huh? want to say GoBots, but that's a completely separate franchise. So I'm assuming like Mighty Changing Robot Carman Godzilla. That's a pretty good fucking guess, actually. The reorganizers. <laughs> that's a. Give us I money guess. now. No. Fight Super Robot Lifeform Transformers. Uh -uh. Oh. That's that's what Transformers is called. All right, are you ready, Neil? I think so. All right, everybody, welcome back and give it up for Neil Wright. He's a lion, he's on my side. Scares my friends a little bit, but that's all right. I would like to lay down on his rock in the sun. He's the only lion in this life of mine. He's a lion, he's on his way. Keep my evil demons in the light of bay. I know it's a laugh to hear me say. He's the only lion in my life today. Special passenger, he's my special passenger, that's right, my special passenger, he's my special passenger, that's right, my special passenger, he's my special passenger, all right, my special passenger. Thank you. Yeah! Woo! That was a snake one, right? It was. What? I couldn't, didn't catch his name in that one. He, his name is actually not mentioned. Oh, well he that. Unsung hero. What's his name? Geisty. Geisty? Yes, yeah, really. Like Poltergeisty? Poltergeist. Yeah, Poltergeisty. All right, all right. That's delightful. Thank you so much for coming and playing. Well, thank you for having me. I may fun. have accidentally killed a fish. Will you write its eulogy? <laughs> I would love to. Excellent. That's my specialty, actually. Good to know. Fishulogies? Yeah. Fishulogies. Fishulogies. That song, actually, um, I probably shouldn't say this, but I'm going to because it's funny. Mm -hmm. um, when I first, so I actually submitted it to a compilation, and when I first submitted it, 
Um, no, my, my friends who heard it didn't know what it was about, and they guessed what it was about, and their guess, well, let's just say it was not PG. <laughs> <laughs> about what the song yes. was about, so also a penis. Just, just think. Of it. <laughs> okay, well, yeah. But and that, then li penis, listening to it again, yeah. I was like, that does kind of make sense. <laughs> yeah. uh, Your special passenger. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Yep. There's a there's a lot in there that really fits. But I swear, it's all from it, it all also makes. It's sense. It's all from playing with snake. your snake. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's an easy. Letting it slide between your fingers. Mm-hmm. It's something that haunts you. Uh. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow. This got dark real quick. Well, it needs to, because here's the thing. This might be adventures in broadcasting today, with it the is. heroic effort of the background room and us just making it up as we go. Mm -hmm. yeah. But in five seasons, when we're rich and famous on that public access television money, <laughs> our, sweet, sweet. And we can money. we can do a throwback joke to this that our four viewers who actually <laughs> you know are watching now yeah. will get. And if you're watching now, you'll be really cool then, because you'll know. You'll have been there from the beginning. That's right. You are the hipsters of Peaport. P P or T. So you won't like us later when we get popular, but for I, now. Yeah, when we sell out, like down. we get it. Yeah, no, I am selling the fuck out the first opportunity yeah. I get. Like if someone offers me five bucks to smack someone around here, I'm taking it. Yeah, and we'll let him. Mm -hmm. Give me a buck twenty-five of it. I'll be the person you can smack around. <laughs> All right. I feel like this is just another episode. We were wanting to have a fighting episode. I All you. right. Oh, fighting episode. <laughs> you know, bring want, my luchador mask. You want to come back for our that. fighting episode? Yeah, do, I mean, do I fight? Do I have to fight anyone? Not necessarily. Do I, I mean, we get to fight anyone? There's do you only want to fight somebody? There's only two um, rules for Fight Club. You don't stop till someone's bleeding. Mm -hmm. And fighting? Yeah. And fighting. So, and you give up all earthly possessions, because possessions don't matter in Fight Club. Basically what I'm saying is, do you want to come into a room later and wrestle? <laughs> <laughs> Only if I can bring my snake. <laughs> Special passenger. <laughs> We've heard oh, great man. things about it. Oh, and oh, man. Look. It's just a whole episode of us saying inappropriate things. Yes. Like... Okay. On a whole spectrum. The animated, <laughs> the animation episode becomes, watch us say horrible things. <laughs> You feel like <laughs> want to be surprised what we'll say? Watch the cartoon episode. Uh, Have you been offended recently? We can help. <laughs> <laughs> Who wants to play another game? Sure. We, have time? Oh, we got time. We totally have time. What are we this playing? This one is color palettes. We uh, are going yeah. to look at different color palettes. Mm -hmm. And you have to tell me what cartoon it's for. That's some high goddamn. Uh, right there. SpongeBob SquarePants. I don't know. SpongeBob SquarePants. Look. I just like SpongeBob SquarePants. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go by your accent and say Rocky and Bullwinkle. All right, Rocky and Bullwinkle, SpongeBob SquarePants. Donald Duck. I'm a little disappointed in you, son. Oh. Ah. He man. Oh. Herman. Look at him. Look at him. The T man. So yeah. I'm, I'm curious, like, how different are all of the color palettes? All of them are different. Okay, well, I'm we will ready. find out. Like snowflakes. Adventures in color. What's Ooh, this? the purple is. Does that look interesting? How does that look? Does that show Andrew. I'm guessing TMNT, Futurama. I'm gonna I'm gonna guess TN TNMT also, because you know that purple Donatello could hey. be. Y'all yep. nailed it. It is oh, Teenage Mutant nice. Ninja Turtles. I yeah. We nailed it. Leonardo used to be Two my points. favorite, but then I realized he's actually the most boring. But he has a sword. No, like Leonardo him. is the best. He's the responsible one. He yeah, makes sure everything keeps going. He might not be the coolest, but he is the lifeblood of that team. Right. Speaking as the only responsible person to ever live at the Watts house, it's not the best. Uh, hmm. Excuse me. I'm the one who pays all of the bills. Now you are. I'm, I'm the one. I'm the one who carried drunk asses upstairs. You only paid Comcast. I've been paying all of them since the get-go, boo. I mean, I to, to be fair, the book. sword <laughs> is I don't know you the <laughs> most <laughs> efficacious I think weapon. Tony does. The sword? Well, I mean, you've the got like, a guy with a stick, oh. a guy with two small sticks attached by a chain, and then a guy with like basically a fork. Right. And then you've got an actual sword. So. Right, but it's Just based on Japanese weaponry, which means something that's not going to break, something that probably won't break, stuff you use to tend the fields, and you get one good hit and it shatters. 
<laughs> so wait. <laughs> so color palettes. Color palettes. Color palettes. In our last Unless I'm offending files now. Anybody? Um, I don't want to guess. Um, what do we uh, want to guess? Uh, Adventure Time. I'm going to guess Adventure Time on this one. Because Princess Bubblegum. You I'll know let Neil's got else. this shit. I'm backing him on Adventure Time. All right. I don't know. As I have the ability to see through white pieces of paper to images Damn behind it, it I'm going to say Ren and Stimpy. It's Ren and Stimpy. Oh, <laughs> I've been betrayed by my sunglasses. It Vision is Ren powers. and Stimpy. Visual right. powers. Interesting. Um, what about this color palette, kid? I'm going to say Ah Real Monsters. Ooh, that is a good one. That was one. a good cartoon. It's a good pull, but I think those are a little more vibrant. Yeah, um, it's a, theirs are more like dull. Um, the original Dungeons and Dragons cartoon? Ooh. SpongeBob SquarePants. Again. Nailed it! It's yeah! Oh, Nail Nailed it. Oh, sorry. I know, I'm just going to keep saying I'm going to make that a catchphrase. Wait, I'm into it. All right. I'm going to cover up since we have Cheaty McCheaterson. Yeah, too late. I cheated. Uh, Damn it. Uh, we'll go to you last. Uh, I don't know. Let's see. Um, what is it? I'll show the cameras if one of them's on. I don't know. Do you see it? Uh, Do you see this hmm. beautiful color? Down. Ru <laughs> up. <laughs> Ru rug rat. No, no. Not rug rat. It's got to have... It like what? Hmm. Got a lot of green. Carry the three. Can I just say? I'm gonna say GI Joe. GI Joe. I'm gonna say Adventure Time again because that's <laughs> I don't know. I believe I saw a Powerpuff Girl. It is the Powerpuff Girl. Oh, that makes so much sense. That does yeah, now. Look at the Powerpuff yeah. Girls. Look at the Powerpuff Girls. They're down here. Yeah, I forgot Why about that cartoon. Why is the camera aimed at my tits? <laughs> Why do you think Tony for positioned ratings? it? For ratings. That's fair. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> That's what we're going for here, ratings. Look, he aimed right. it at each of our adventure here, time. Here is the final color palette. My Take guess is going to be adventure time adventure again. Can I cheat time. on this one? I'm going G.I. Joe again. I'm going adventure Cause, time. Because he has cause it's got red, white, and blue me. in it. This is America. It worked that one time, so it must work every time. It's DuckTales! Woo! Look at him. Look at him all uh, DuckTales. Yeah. Uh, every day. Yeah. They We're failed. out there making. It's all right. For some reason, we just didn't do Adventure Time anything. Um, I have a quick thing to say about DuckTales. Do it. If we have time. We do. The soundtrack to the NES game DuckTales is amazing. Especially the moon level. Yes. Yeah. So go. Game is great. Check that Which out. They recently re-released yeah. on like all of the all major right. platforms. Oh, they did? Yeah. You can get it on nice. PC. You can get it on Xbox Live. You can get it on P all the other places yeah it's so fine. therefore you have no reason not to listen to it viewer viewer v viewer 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 where are you viewer 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 viewer, viewer. 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 go listen to it <laughs> viewer I'm, I'm i'm sort of sad that we've almost hey. finished a show and haven't mentioned steven universe i know i'm sort of sad about that too i've been really obsessed with it what uh, is that i don't know that steven is. universe is the most amazing cartoon that's what happened to me right now it, it is Watch it. Yeah. It's so good. It has all of the like big world storytelling of Avatar, The Last Airbender, not the movie. Fuck that shit. Um, with the like fun and pop and wonderfulness of Adventure Time. Okay. So it, it's oh, about a world. Well, our world, but there are gems that are that are superheroes. We have 30 seconds. We're gonna say and thank you, and uh, we love Steven Universe. Uh, thank you to Neil and Brandon and Andrew, who I forgot, and all of the crew. How did you forget uh, me? Except Danny, who's just sitting, distracting except people. Except for Danny. No right. thanks to Danny. And shout out to Dan Hammond. <laughs> <laughs> and, and enjoy and your I night with Amanda. You. All right. We know you won't remember no it in the morning. Round, roll the we love Scientology. <laughs>